It's in November when our board of directors supported the Colorado Compact but under the leadership of Senator Michael Bennett. We weren't certain this was the issue that could actually pass through the halls of Congress. Make no mistake, Senator Bennett's leadership has been extraordinary on this issue, bringing this kind of coalition together, and he really needs to be recognized for this first massive step, and there's another massive step to go. On behalf of our business community, we've studied this issue extensively, and we find the more we look at it, the more we look at the issue, the more we look at the research, the more necessary it needs to happen now rather than later. Ladies and gentlemen, our system is broken. We know it's broken. And if you look at it in a political issue, it somewhat seems unsolvable. But the reason we came to the position of supporting not only the compact, but what the U.S. Senate has done, is because we looked at it in a business way. We have to bring talented workers that want to work hard into America. Our businesses are demanding it in this worldwide economy. We also have to bring in workers that are willing to just plain work hard and want the freedom that the U.S. provides. The combination of very smart and very hardworking people that want to benefit our economy has made the majority of our organization feel very strongly in favor of this. But we also urge Coloradoans and Americans to support this for a human reason. When you put a face on this, and realize that the individual behind really wants to make a difference for themselves, their family, their neighborhood, their community, and hopefully their new nation. This becomes a no-brainer. Somehow, we all have to figure out the politics in order to make it happen. And the South Metro Denver Chamber is strongly in favor of this today. Thank you all for being here on a big national issue. Um, it's going to save America money. The Congre Congressional Budget Office has pointed out in the next 10 years, this will save $200 billion, and the following decade after that, $700 billion. So whether you look at it in a small business sense, a large business sense, or a human business sense, or to benefit America, this is the right issue to get behind, and you've got to get our Repub Republican friends on board. I'm a former elected Republican from Arapahoe County. And I'm telling you, we have to get the Republicans on board. There's plenty to fight about in America. Let's fight about other things and get this done. Yeah.